So Uncle Wilbert and I finally got around to going to Zealandia, which is a lovely little wildlife reserve in the middle of Wellington. It's very, actually it's quite large. It's completely fenced in and the fences are, well they're really tall so people can't, so people, animals can't jump over them and they've got uh, the, uh, what's down here? Uh, the fence and the thing so animals can't climb up the fence and then go in. Um, it's a native reserve so it's mostly birds and lizards. Um, yeah, it's pretty much what it is, birds and lizards. And maybe some other things, but uh, it's Zealandia is you, you, there's hiking trails through it, and you go up and you can either stay on the red path, which is very straight, and up to the upper dam, and then go down to the and then back. But Uncle Wilbert and I went on the Sky View Trail, I think it is. It's the green trail. It's a little bit harder, not very much. It's just like actually, it reminded me a lot of uh, the hike to Horns Butte, especially when you go up through. Uncle almost Uncle Les's landing, but you turn left, and then you go up through those trees, and you have this this bit where you have to go down this really steep bit, and then up the other steep bit that's covered in trees, right before you go through the big brambles of trees where we almost step on that snake right before the road. It reminded me a lot of that in a couple places. Uh, there was also an old abandoned gold mine that you can't really go into all that far, but still pretty cool. It's also very short. I hate to be a gold miner. I have headaches galore, but... um. So we, we did that, and we took a couple of the pies that I made. Uh, there were two leftover meat pies, and I took two of the leftover apple pies. And we had those for lunch on the way, just a little picnic stop. And uh, there's a lot of birds in there. And yeah, a couple, you, you see a uh, you hear a bird. You see a bird's like, oh, what's that? And I, it's a bird. It's a bird. Yes, yes, that is a bird. Very good. Yes, it was, a, it was. There was a lot of that going on. Get really annoyed at birds. <laughs> but saw a tui. Heard a tui. Tui sound really weird. They are the funniest sounding birds. Tui's are. And saw a couple of these weird native pigeon things. I don't remember the names. Their names are kind of complicated. They're no longer in danger. And saw tuataras, like actual tuataras, like the dinosaur lizards that we saw on Dominic Monaghan's Wild Things. Like the actual thing, and they were just sitting there, and they had a little they had on the on the fence by the the main path. They have a fence, so you can't you know go tramping off into the bush. But uh, they have steps, and they have a little lizard. And I'm guessing that people walk up and down, and they report where they are, and they put the steps there. But they have a little this little home. This one was a couple of them were little, like little pipes, and there was a little lizard sign on the fence. And you look over, and my goodness gracious, there is a tuatar just sitting there on the ground waiting to be looked at. That is so cool. So, took Money Bunny to Zealandia and it was a lot of fun. And then we went home and ate way too much food. <laughs> Had baked potatoes, verjuice glazed chicken, and vegetables. And I couldn't finish. I just didn't even try. Because it was, it was really good food. Especially the baked potato. I had been a while since I had baked potatoes. It's probably since... <gasps> oh yeah, we had the time we had them with Sandy. And... It was really good. But yes, so we went to the Zealandia finally. Took a while, but finally got around to doing it. So now the only thing left on my list in Wellington is Weta Cave, I think. That won't happen for a couple of days. A couple of weeks, probably. <laughs>